Now, it's time for the Friday Night Channel 7 Spoo News Update. Keep up with the Spoo Town action live every Friday at twitch.tv slash spoo. Good evening, Spoo Town. I am Seymour Dinglebutts for Spoo's News. Well, unless you have been under a rock this week, you will not have been able to miss the fact that the streamer has stayed committed to grinding his face off. He has used every trick in the book to get racers on his tracks. Extra spoobles, offers of subs, entries to the showdown, merch, and even cold hard cash. Is there any level this streamer won't stoop to get top three? We don't think so. So talking about those spooble winners, who seem to be popping up all over the place this month. Here is the shout out to those that have won since last week. Thank you to Shadowhunter Fizz who has been adding the results to the Facebook page and also to Twitter. Please check out Spootown socials for more details. And if you are still using Facebook, please stop by and give the post a thumbs up. Again, congratulations to our Spoobal winners. You can flex your power in any stream playing marbles on stream. This week in a bizarre turn of events, Spoos News has been involved in preparations for a manhunt. Yes, you guessed it, the great and powerful Pixel has been AWOL in New World again and so we had drafted up some flyers and milk cartons to help track him down. Luckily for us, the dingus showed up and even dropped some balls with the streamer to help with his quest for top 3 greatness. Pixel, please make sure you text someone when you are going to be late for dinner. Please do not accept candy from strangers and make sure you look both ways when you are crossing the road. We really worry about you and we want to ensure you are keeping safe. In regards to the top three spots, we know that someone will miss out. Iguan has already secured a masterful lead so there simply is no challenge on first place this month. We are not quite sure what substances Sin has been on to ensure he can stay awake, but he has been rolling with very few breaks and even offering a large cash prize which has brought in the crowds. Sin will of course gain a massive boost during Marble Fest, will it be enough to snag second place? Only time will tell. It's been a torrid month for the Tony Blacks, internet issues, OBS fails the passing of his doggo and a health scare for his grandfather. We know that the fam are behind Tony and trying to raise his spirits but it seems like it's all been slightly stacked against him this time. Bringing back old Spoo has been an event in itself but we think you have got this one boss. I have been Seymour Dinglebutts for Spooist News. Have a great rest of the season Spoo Town.